Hey, this is Tanisha, and I hope you stick around and watch how I created the Freedom Series, the painting here right on the screen. So before I get totally into the painting, I thought I would tell you more about myself. My name is Tanisha. I am the owner of Katia.co. I'm starting this YouTube channel because I really hope to get to know more people and actually help others, help other people on their mission to make art or just find freedom in their lives. And so this painting, I decided to create this because I have dealt with a lot of perfectionism in my life. I'm not perfect by any means, but when I'm at work or working for someone else, I'm always trying to do the very best I can. And sometimes that it's a good thing, but then it can be a hindrance. So when I found my love of art, one thing that I come to learn about it is how freeing it is and, and how being free and just creating, allowing yourself to create is, is something that I, I needed, but I didn't know I needed. And so while I was really digging more into the art world, I started to realize that there's no room for, for perfection here. I mean, there's room for it, but when you're creative, you have to let yourself be creative, which means you have to be a little bit more freer, freer to make more mistakes, just free. And I feel like this is what art is teaching me and why I need art so much myself. And so I was on, I had been kind of putting art off a little bit. I would do it sometimes, then I wouldn't. Because again, I was trying to find a way to perfect it. Oh, let me learn how to do this right. Let me learn how to do this perfect. And I just decided one day, I was telling myself, let's forget perfect. Let's not even think about it. Let's just make art. And that's why I decided to create the Freedom Series. And I went into this thinking, this is not about perfection. This is not about getting everything right. This is not even about following the rules. And yes, the rules of design are very important, but the purpose of this piece was beyond the rules. The purpose of this piece was to finish something and to be free while creating it and not thinking about it because I spent my life thinking a lot about the rules. And if you're like me, you spent your life thinking about the rules, the last you think you need is more rules. And so while I do have much respect for following the rules, I also believe there's times when we just have to be free. And so when I created this piece, I was thinking, I don't really care if anyone buys it or not. But what was more important to me was that I would allow myself to be free to create without thinking about anything. And that's what this piece is all about. And I hope to inspire other people to do the same thing if you've been living your life dealing with perfectionism or dealing with pleasing people uh, thinking too much about anything art is a really good place to let go be free and you don't have to make art to sell art you don't have to sell it you can do this for yourself for your own healing so for me What's really important is let's just finish something, but let's have fun while we're doing it. There's no reason why, you know, I can't just have fun making this art. I don't have to do everything perfect. So if anything, I hope this inspires you to take some steps to make art, make art for fun, make art because it's going to free you from something that has been holding you down. And not only am I about being free in this way, but I'm, I'm, I'm all about, and I've, over the last several years, I've been on this mission to be free to be myself, to love myself, to be me and be okay with being me. Be okay with being different. And that's what I hope to encourage people to do. Be okay being you. And this art piece is, has so much meaning to me. Um, 
and it's not just about a pretty piece of artwork which I end up liking it I like the colors that I used and but I had so much fun being free and not caring so I encourage you to give it a try and see how it goes for you just grab some paper and just go at it pick some colors and just think like this I don't have to sell this I don't have to please anyone all I have to do is just be myself let myself have fun and just play around <laughs> and it's so much fun and it's so freeing so that's a little bit about me uh, that's that's what the purpose of this this uh, artwork is it's also the mission in my life I really want to encourage other people to be free to be themselves to enjoy life because I live so much of my life caring about what people thought or think about me and you know will they like me will they not like me and that gets old real quick and I think for us to truly be who we are we have to love ourselves and I want to be who God made me to be I want to be that person because there's a reason why I'm here on this earth and I believe that for you and so yeah give it a try and I think you'll you'll enjoy it so in this part of the video I thought I would just go ahead and just tell you a little bit about what I'm doing so what I've been learning about myself is that I really love lines I love line work I love a lot of weird shapes I usually like more hardcore shapes not so much soft shapes but I did make some soft shapes in here but as time has gone on and as you start to see more videos from me you'll see how my art has changed uh, I really enjoy Posca pens those are my favorite so that's what I'm using right now and I, one of the things you probably can hardly see is there's a clear piece of paper here that I'm using to test marks on my art it was it was a way for me to not fully go all the way in I guess there's where that perfection likes to drop in right let me get it perfect <laughs> I guess I can't totally stay away from it but in any case I continued on and start painting again and here I started to realize oh this doesn't look like the right color I, I think it was a little bit off and, and that's another really good lesson <laughs> Is that make enough color for your entire piece of artwork and uh, it looks like I got a little bit off but you'll see towards the end that everything turned out fine and I really I really love the colors uh, how they all look together so the paint that I'm using here is mostly Nova color paint I really like their paint if you haven't heard of it you'll definitely hear me talk more about it you can find out more about it at novacolor.com it's a paint that you have to order online it is not uh, you can't find it in stores and that's how they keep the price down so it's they're basically selling it direct to consumer so you'll definitely want to check them out golden i know is one of the most popular paints out there and i absolutely love golden but this is a really great alternative if you like to have great paint but less cost and it's really vibrant paint i mean it looks it's beautiful in person and so again you can see me using this clear sheet because at this point i thought okay let me try to calm down this this um, abstract work because it is a little bit busy and of course i'm still fighting my need for perfectionism but we keep going <laughs> i just keep going and i'm giving it a go and giving it all i have and so right now I'm just doing a little bit of refining and painting away some of the what I've considered the craziness of the painting. And so the basically when this is done, I end up with two art pieces which you saw at the beginning. And I currently have them uh, available as art prints and not so much original art I don't know if I'll ever sell the original art it's something I'm thinking about but I'm not quite sure but in any case it, the original looks great uh, 
the paint was really good and I really enjoy having this video as well to just kind of go back and look at what I did working so hard to try not to allow the perfectionist in me to stop the progress and pause things because sometimes when you're dealing with perfectionism it's so easy to just get stuck and you can it take you a while to just come to a decision but all in all i'm really proud of what i created and i hope you are enjoying watching this creation as you um if you watch more of the videos i'm going to have a lot of um, abstract paint with me sessions i'm also into polymer clay so i started art um, my art journey by creating polymer clay earrings so we're definitely going to have videos on polymer clay earring making and so much more so i hope you subscribe i hope you stick around and i hope to get to know you better and i hopefully in the future planning to have some live streams where we can paint together i really look forward to getting to know more people and helping people as much as i can on this journey to find freedom within yourself and so this is pretty much the end of this painting i really hope you enjoyed it and definitely let me know what you think in the comments do you ever deal with being problems being free let me know and i'll be talking to you again soon